It's Sage, it's a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, uh, pleasure to meet you too. I heard a little bit about this new movie, Roswell Delirium. Um, yeah, did catch the trailer to it. It looks pretty interesting and great cast. And um, hearing about you, um, that you're in it and you're playing uh, the grandson of D. Walls's character, I think that's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty nerve wracking, but yeah, it's awesome. <laughs> so, um, can you tell us a little bit about the character you're playing in the film? So Mickey in this um in this movie um there's radiation poisoning that's uh hit uh the United States and I'm kind of like um I I get really sick from the radiation and I in my uh D Wallace who who um who plays my uh, grandmother is trying to help me uh uh to um get unsick from the uh the radiation fallout yeah oh wow that's interesting yeah yeah and i mean the cast i mean i look at the cast right now and i'm like wow you got like an 80s you know, I, yeah. grew up, I grew up with that era so you got like d wallace the absolute legend sam jones you know flash gordon anthony michael hall lisa walshall reginald vell johnson i mean i grew up watching these guys <laughs> so many years um, did you get to share the screen with any other any of the other legends or it was just D with you? Um, D was there, but uh Anthony, um he, he wasn't in my scene, but he was there. I, I got to talk to him a little bit. Um he was watching um um kind of like uh me uh filming my scene, how it was playing out. So I got to talk to him about, you know, being in the Breakfast Club and Batman. That was that's pretty awesome. Because I'm a I'm a big fan of the '80s, so you know I love the Breakfast Club, Back to the Future, Ferris Bueller, any of that is, is my jam right there. There you go, exactly. Yeah. You know, I grew up during that era, so I used to watch Weird Science. You know, the Breakfast Club. I used to watch all those films like relentlessly. Yeah. And so, what was it like working with um Richard Bakewell, the writer and director of the film? Richard Bakewell is one of those like directors that really gets his actors he you know he's multi-talented he's a cinematographer he's like uh he works uh, in camera he, he's a director of course he, he he knows a lot of different stuff and also he's an actor he just macking as well so he really knows different uh departments of um the acting field which um which i feel like really helps me as an actor because he understands uh acting and all different parts of like lighting and stuff so he's a very personal he's a very personal actor's director yeah that's really cool and uh yeah it seems like a really good film in terms of what to expect um did, did you get to see the final film yet or did you get would you get to stay on set and watch the deals are you waiting for that world no premiere? no i i know nothing about it <laughs> <laughs> i'll be i'll be surprised when it when it comes out um, all right. And when when are we expecting the release of this movie? Um, there's not there's not like we don't have like a date yet. Like he said that it's supposed to come out like somewhere around like late kind of summer period. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, I'm I'm hoping people will get to check this out. And um who knows? And you know, who knows? This might even be your breakout role. You might end up getting a really good career in acting the way things are going. Yep. So do you have any new projects on the horizon after this film that you can talk about or you just wait I, to see what happens? I do. I have a um an I have an animation um where I play like a prince, but I can't really say much about that, but it's an independent uh, animation. Yeah, which I I do mocap. It's all remote. I I'm uh I, it's my first time doing vo vo uh, voice acting, which is very exciting. Um, I'm I'm doing also the motion capture, which is uh, which is uh, awesome. And also, I'm doing this um, 
this movie called ZZZ, which is uh, the director is Felipe Vargas, and he's currently doing the new Leprechaun movie over yeah. at Lionsgate. So I'm really excited about that. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, I did hear about that, that he's doing the new Leprechaun. I'm like, I'm really stoked for that because I, I, also, I also love horror movies. And, you know, when it's a new reboot or something coming out, I was like, I have to see it just to see if it's as good as the original. <laughs> yeah. Like, there's some stuff you can't remake, some stuff you can, but some stuff you can. And so, yeah, yeah. waiting to see how this one comes out. But, yeah, um, awesome. but yeah, definitely, I'm definitely look out for both Roswell Delirium and ZZZ. I hope they become, you know, breakout roles for you. And then uh, this animation you. one comes out. I'll definitely check that one out as well. And thank you again so much for taking the time to talk about it. Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you for having me. All right. No problem. You take care. Yeah. Have a good day. Yeah. Take care. All right. All right. Bye. Bye.